We believe that all men are created equal, yet many are denied equal treatment. Every nation must now develop an overriding loyalty. Welcome to Diversity TV, news and commentary. I'm Troy Shaw. Let's talk about Dwayne the Dog Chapman, star of Dog the Bounty Hunter. Recently, he made some very disparaging comments to an African-American girl who is dating his son. This is what he said. I'm not taking a chance on some mother I don't care if she's a Mexican, a whore, whatever. It's not because she's black. It's because we use the word nigger sometimes here. I'm not going to take a chance ever in life of losing everything I've worked for for 30 years because some nigger heard us say nigger and turned us into the Enquirer magazine. Our career is over. Me personally, I, 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 I took offense, very offense, to his, com to his comments. Even though they were private, you have to admit that is in that man's heart. I believe that Dwayne is a racist because I've heard many times what he says about me, not just this one time, but a lot of things he does. He never met this young woman and he's even admitted that in the interview. I have never met her. She's a cute little girl. I didn't know that. I never know what she looked like. I think ultimately Dwayne the Dog Chapman is just really upset more about anything that he got caught using the word. I did not mean to add yet another slap in the face to an entire race of people who have brought so many gifts to this world. My sincerest heartfelt apologies go out to every person I offended for my regrettable use of very inappropriate language. I am deeply disappointed in myself. You heard him in the comments, you know, I, 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 America would take offense to me using the word. I don't really mean it this way, but they would they would think that I meant it in a negative sense. Here's the thing. All that being said, Dwayne the Dog Chapman should be given another chance. Every human being should be given another chance. The man makes millions of dollars now, never seen money like that in his life, and he's using that money to basically raise his family. He says he's learned the error of his ways, and every human being should be given the opportunity. Every American should be given the opportunity to do for his or her family. That being said, let's talk a little bit about the, the use of the word, the N-word, by rappers. Rappers use it all the time, and we let it go. Obviously, Dwayne the Dog Chapman knows that America and businesses are not going to support his television program if he uses that word, right? They won't support him. a and &E canceled the show. But every single day, every single year, we hear new rap lyrics utilizing that word, and corporate America supports black people utilizing the word. The NAACP has, has thought the word was so egregious, they buried the word at their very last convention. We should take note. The use of the N-word is not a positive word, regardless of whether or not it's used by blacks or regardless of whether or not it's used by whites. It's a negative word that describes black people in a negative light. A slave-oriented word that has hurt people for hundreds of years. The word needs to be buried not only in the white community, but it certainly needs to be buried in the black community. Every African-American rapper that utilized the word needs to apologize to his fellow brother or sister. Because when you use that word, you do give credence to the use of the word by other people. Nobody should be able to arbitrarily have use of a word if it's disparaging towards another race of people, even if those people are the race that is being used on disparagingly. A few announcements here. If you haven't had the opportunity to become a reporter with the Diversity Television Network, quite simple to do it. All you need is a webcam and a story, and you can send it to us at diversitytv.net forward slash contact. We'll get right back to you. And as well, please take a look at our site here. We have a bunch of resources for you. We have the Job and Recruitment Channel. We have the Hotel and Travel Channel and the Real Estate Channel and our selected programming that will help you in your daily lives. And again, I'm Troy Shaw with Diversity TV News and Commentary, and I'll see you very soon.
We believe that all men are created equal. Yet many are denied equal treatment. Every nation must now develop an overriding loyalty. 